Hi guys. So in last video under util crisis, we created one delete method and uh, sorry, uh, not delete method, uh, put method. And uh, this is what we created. And in this, we passed two things, the URL we passed and the body. And based on that, whatever details we wanted to update, for example, name and date of birth, we updated and it was working fine. Okay, so this method, this created method is working fine now. Now, now the next one, next one we are going to write for delete method. This is the one which is left. Okay, so let me see, see how many users are present currently in our uh, uh, application. Currently, we have. Uh, how many users are there five users right so the first user is having with id one the second user is having with id six and the third user is uh, having id nine likewise okay so in delete user we have this is what the the data we are go, uh, using to delete okay so in this what is having we have one data variable in that variable we are passing the id of the user okay which we want to delete okay so for example suppose let's delete this one okay so this is nine okay user id with nine okay and let me check others should not have any way our id is unique so so with one id only one details can be there okay yeah so with this nine is there right we'll try to delete this using postman and then we'll automate okay what was the id for that for id is nine okay let me hit this yeah 200 okay we got 200 okay we got let me hit this get user cpi and we will see whether that is available or not so id one is there id six is there see id nine is not there that got deleted right see 15 and 18 are there okay now let's do the same thing using uh using our framework okay so for that what we need we just need need one url we need to pass in that one data is there that data we can send it using map like how we saw in the get request okay so let me copy this okay and then let me paste it over here and we can make it delete okay and so this name you can give anything okay so i'm uh, for put i'm using put for delete i'm using delete uh, delete you can give an like i can give delete user okay let me do it here like that okay delete user okay i can put delete also delete user also but this is very important okay this one this one should be delete only okay for put it should be put for post it should be post okay now now what see we created this this method right delete user now what we need to pass we need to pass this url and along with that one map object and in that map object what data we will be passing we will be passing data with value 9 okay now let's go and create a method for that so what and all we need we need one map object right right so this is what it is and in map object what we need we need integer right one url will be string uh, this name will be string like data and this one will be our integer okay so let me make it integer okay perfectly fine now let me put data data and value will be like one okay perfectly fine now this data we don't need not so, so which one we want to delete we will be deleting okay let's delete this one okay id with 15 okay so data should be 15 okay and what is this data this data name should be similar okay should be similar to what we are going to use see here we are using data right so that is data okay now now whatever uh, that delete method we have created right in that delete me method also it is expecting integer only perfectly fine now now we should go and create one uh object of this one so that we can call this method right delete user so object of rest util already we have created and that is called utils okay okay so using this object we can call that method right so let me go here 
utils dot delete c delete user okay what is this error control space perfectly fine so in this delete user what we need to pass we need to pass the url and this is what the url is and map object so this is what our map object is so copy it and paste it over here okay perfectly fine okay and in response we are not getting anything right so we'll not get anything anyway let it be there but we, anyway it will not do anything okay and this update we don't need this okay so response is also not required but let it be there okay so now we are done we are ready we are ready to go but one thing what is our url url is first important right so this is got our url base url along with that uh, a resource okay and then this query parameter will get added automatically so till users we need to have this okay so till users we need to paste it over here now perfectly fine so now which one we are going to use let me hit the get cut state get users details and we'll see what and all users are available okay so let me end it so first user is with id 1 second one is with id 6 third one is 15 and the fourth one is with 18 and which one we are going to delete we are going to delete the 15th one so this user we are going to delete okay so let's right click and run it and this user's code is not required because we are not using it anywhere perfectly fine right click run as test ng okay yeah perfect so it is passed right so it means the delete user we are using and this is what the url it hit hit okay and this is what the data is equal to 15 be passed right right now let's go here and hit this get users details okay see here id with 15 it is all one is already there with six is there and now you can see 18 is there that 15 one is deleted right see this is how we can use this delete api okay and uh, oh, what is the name name we have kept it is like update okay Let's make it delete this name can be anything like this is the method name no we can give anything okay so now this is what the delete api is and how we can use this just we saw it let me try it with one more example so let me delete the id id1 let me delete this id okay so just pass it one over here right click run as this one perfectly fine let's go here and hit the get car get user details see id1 is not there now it got deleted only two records we have id6 and id18 right so this is how we can use our delete api okay yeah that's it for this video thank you guys